Situated in the heart of northern Mindanao, Bukidnon State University in Malaybalay City is one of the country's premier educational institutions. It has produced and nurtured generations of leaders and professionals. I am Rod Bolivar and this is Buxo TV. Education is said to be the great equalizer to our society. An access to education is an indispensable wealth that can change lives and build a nation. Through the government's universal access to free education, we are building generations of Filipinos who are movers of change and builders of our country's future. Yan at di ay si De Vera Lumista Timpasal na poon tamaga bulunay impasok ong bukid nun. Miembro ho higaonon ta impasok ong sa Corso Co Public Administration, BPA 2, then 21 years old. Growing up in one of the most remote villages in Impasugong, Bukidnon, access to government services remain a challenge to the family of Devera Tipasal and her fellow Higaunon residents. But Devera remains hopeful that she will attain the best education, that one day she will be able to serve her community and uplift their lives. Ang akong mga kaagi at tong elementary ko to high school, grade 1 to grade 4, dito ako sa amo ang nag-skwela. Pagka grade 5, nag ko sa barangay Bulon na Ipasagong Bukid noon. Gabaklay mi og 7 kilometers. Then kung gakahurot among balon, kanang adlaw, magulik mi sa amo ah, pagkahapon. Then magbalik ra po dahil, magbaklay pagkabuntag. Pagka grade 6, dito ko nag sa sa Malonsagay Elementary School. Then pagka grade 7 to grade 12, Dito ko sa Pusdi, Gabaklay na po dahil makes 14 kilometers. Kung gaskwela mi sir, kaya Gabaklay ragyut bi din, gapasan-pasan sa among kahoy, sa among balon, nga kamuti, binggala nga. I-estimit yun na muna siya nga one week. Through the universal access to free higher education, Devera's dreams are within reach. She is currently on her sophomore year at Bukidnon State University taking a Bachelor of Science in Public Administration. Ang akong pangandis, akong kinabuhi, makahuman kong skwela para matabangan ako akong ginikanan o labi na sa amu, amua dito sa among bukin nga gusto po ko nga ma-encourage na ko sila nga magpadayan og eskwela bisan tuod og kanang bukid yun amua kinanglam ko nga mupatong misa syudad Since it was enacted into law the Republic Act 1093 or the Universal Access to Free Higher Education is able to send millions of Filipinos to all state universities and state colleges around the country Aside from free education Devera is also able to avail of the financial grant from the Commission on Higher Education through its tertiary education subsidy program. Devera used her allowance for her personal needs and for the school materials needed for her studies. Financially secure ko sir, then makahuman yun kong eskwela ko, magtinarong lang kong eskwela, then ang akong pinaka-the best yun ng experience sir, kay na, natuman yun ako akong dream nga magtudlo ko sa amung as sir. Bisan sa pila na kaadlaw, pero marag happy kayo ko na na-share po. Kung unsa ang nahahatag sa TES, ako ang na-share po dako sa uban sir. Noong Agosto 2017, pinirmahan ng Presidente yung uh, RA10931. So mula June ng 2018, lumawak yung saklaw ito. Libreng tuition, libreng miscellaneous fees, at lumawak din yung mga makikinabang na estudyante. Dati, 112 state universities and colleges lang. Dinagdagan natin ng 78 local universities and colleges. Bukidnon State University, being forefront university catering municipalities around Bukidnon, including those areas in Misamis Oriental, has always been in adept with how tertiary education could be made available, accessible, and free of those who are willing and deserving students. These TES grantees got as much as 40,000 pesos a year that can be used for books, transportation, supplies, room and board fees, and other education-related expenses. Since the implementation of the Universal Access to Free Higher Education in 2018 until the first semester of 2021, Buxo received a total amount of 728.3 million pesos from the Commission on Higher Education. 
These funds were used for the free higher education program, tertiary education subsidy program, the student financial assistance program, and the Bayanihan 2 for higher education Tulong program. There are already an average of 3,179 students or 25.01% per semester from Bukidnon State University's main campus and from the 16 satellite campuses who are able to benefit from the tertiary education subsidy program. Muna ako ang pagpasalamat sa bukso o sa, or, o sa goberno unta na pa ay ubang mga sadyante nga maka-appeal ni ini nga mga sa sa free higher education aron usab sila maabog pud nila ilahang mga pangandu silang kinabuhi o makatabang usab sa ilahang pamilya dako kay ako pagpasalamat diha kanimo one of Buxo's alumni who benefited from the universal access to free higher education is 23-year-old Fidel Lopez. He finished cum laude under the Bachelor of Science in Accountancy degree program. Before pa sa TS is isa po ka-consistent ka din sister. Since ako ga pa higher years sa akong kurso, mas galisod ang ako mga school requirements. So pag abot sa TS, dako yung guys ang tabang since nakapal ko akong bagong laptop o mas makaprovide pa o kayo sa akong mga school requirements. And as a result, na-maintain na po ang akong pag-adin sister. Bukidnon State University Supreme Student Council celebrates the victory for the present and future generations of our Filipino students on the success and effectivity of Free Higher Education Act and the provision of allowance under UNIFAST. Through this free tuition law, we can now optimize the utilization of government resources in education. It has elicited a wide range of responses. Personally, I'm so happy with the majority of people expressing delight and pleasure of rece receiving free education. Based on a survey conducted by Bukidnon State University to the beneficiaries of the universal access to free higher education, majority of the students came from families with insufficient financial resources to provide for basic personal needs. Their financial resources cannot support school needs and pay fees, and many of the self-supporting students find it hard to sustain their studies. Aside from the financial resources to purchase the basic personal needs and school supplies of the students, the government grants also enable them to address their difficulties in providing for their communication expenses needed in school such as internet and mobile phones. The students said that the tertiary education subsidy program has helped them by providing hope and inspiration in fulfilling their dreams to graduate despite the pandemic. Dako, dako katabang ang financial sa ako mga anak tungo sa ilang mga gamit, mga kasama sa laptop, cellphone, dako kayo na sa ilang kaya naka-internet man sila, o mga uniforms sa eskulahan, o kanin pagbayad sa ilang tunghaan. We all play a role in nation building. We all contribute to the betterment of fellow Filipinos. We all desire to a great Philippines. Indeed, the UNIFAST reconciles, improves, strengthens, expands, and puts under one body of government-funded modalities of student financial assistance programs for tertiary education. We in Bukidnon State University is very much grateful for the support extended to us by our government. Rest assured, as an academic institution in the region, we will always be in support to the plans and goals of the government in promoting available, accessible and free tertiary education in the province through the Commission on Higher Education. Dagang salamat. Through the universal access to free education, all these goals are within reach and we are assured that no Filipino will be left behind. I am Rod Bolivar and this is Buxo TV.